Uh, how are you? How are you doing? I'm doing very well. Welcome to the uh, London International Wine and Spirit Fair 2007. <laughs> okay, thank you. Uh, just a question. Um, we are doing uh, working with a blog in, in Spain about Spanish wineries. Cool. How do you think blogging uh, in Spain um, can be done in the right way? Because the Spanish uh, language in blogging is not the way as the English language. Uh, well, two ways to go about that. You, you, you write, my French guy, the local here does this. Yeah, he's French. He writes his main blog in English, and then he writes one in French. Or maybe he writes it in French and then translates it in English. You can do that. If you're happy, if you're happy limiting yourself to just the Spanish market, that's fine too. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I, I think. I, I mean, I'm Anglo I'm in Anglo centric, so yeah. I say it's probably worth your while writing in English, unless you're just trying to speak in Spaniards. No. But, but that's think, a choice. That's a choice. Yeah, but the way the way you focus it, would it be necessary to to focus? Uh, on the Spanish language and then just translate it into English or would, would it be necessary to have two bloggers one in English the other one in Spanish I think you're better off the, the fewer blogs you have the better yeah. I'd, I'd, I'd say uh, you get somebody who's a really good blogger yeah. and get him to write in Spanish his, his first language and then you find somebody who's a really good translator yeah. and if they know you're Spanish yeah. and your English isn't 100% they'll forgive you yeah. oh, probably will. Yeah. yeah you know it, it, it really is uh, um, you know it, it, if your ideas are good and you know, you know, you uh, screw up the occasional word. Uh, you know, well, we're all human. <laughs> so, okay, that's okay. question number one. Question number one. Question number two. Uh, cooperatives. Excuse me. Cooperatives. Uh, the big cooperatives we have in Spain, like 300 yeah. members, yeah. making making their wines. Yeah. If they think about blogging, uh, should it be one voice, or do you think there could be like 300 voices? All the members uh, talking about the wines. I would, uh, it's a different approach. Group blogs tend to have less personality, and what leads to success in this game is personality. Okay. But you could have a, a home page where it links to all the 300 blogs. But I'd say, yeah. I'd say they're all better off. The other thing is, 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 the other thing about blogging is not everybody's good at it. No. It's like dancing. Yeah, yeah. Some people can do it. Some people cha cha cha, and some people, make it, you know, and uh, blogging is not for everybody. For who is it? People need three things, four things. You need a uh, passion, authority, ability, and continuity. What about authority? How do you get authority in the, in blog, in the blogging world? Uh, you, what does it take? You have to know that. Okay. It, well, you have to know what you're talking about. Yeah. And it, 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 if you start, you're the first person to write about it first. Then you have a considerable authoritative advantage. Mm -hmm. For example, uh, Storm of the First Vineyard started yeah. blogging, yeah. and so all of a sudden we're known as the, the, the Vineyard Blog. Yeah. Uh, and even if somebody comes along and also has a vineyard, who also does what we do, because we got there first, mm -hmm. we made it our we made it our conversation. Yeah. We own that. You know, we own that conversation. And that, that's cool, you know. And, and passion—I don't know where passion comes from. Yeah, they got her, you know. Yeah, that's right. That's yeah. <laughs> that's for sure. Yeah. Passion is something. Yeah, but the Spanish don't have any problems. With that. Oh, they have enough passion. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> no doubt about it. Not really. You don't really have to uh, talk too much. You know, I think uh, yeah. the Sp Spanish probably know a lot more than I do. So. And last question: In the, blo in the blogging world, let's say uh, technology—it's—it's uh, it's an important factor. Um, uh, at what point uh, technology influences the, the Web 2.0 uh, use? Well, you know, I don't, I don't think the technology is that big a deal. I think, I think what's, what's more important is that suddenly we all have a very cheap, easy global media that that requires no third party, really. Uh, that requires no publisher. Requires no paper. Requires no money, it's all of a sudden the, the cost of, any, of anybody saying anything into a global medium has gone a lot lower. And what a great opportunity for some, maybe not for everybody. The great barrier to entry, I think, is writing skills and also being able to find the time, the will, the skill and will. Skill and will, sounds good. Skill and will, sounds good. Write it down. Skill and will, yeah, skill and will, yeah. Okay, thank you. My pleasure. It's a pleasure to talk to you. Yeah, you too.